question if maybe, maybe I bought too much. Let's open it. Hi everyone, and thank you for joining me. I'm Caketons, and today we are doing a massive manga unboxing. I decided for reasons to not open any of my manga parcels for the past, I think it's been three weeks, and thought I'll open them all in a video, and a lot has accumulated. Um, yes, there's a lot. I'm gonna, so I'm gonna push this all to the side, and then we're going to start opening it. What have I bought? Yes. I'm so excited. You might notice I'm trying something new, re repurposing a desk for this unboxing, and borrowed borrowed my desk chair with my fancy ribbon. I put it on for Christmas, and I don't want to take it off because it's great. Right, so what do I need? I need, I need, I need my sharp things, I've got scissors, I've got my box knife, and I need my hydration. This is gonna be a long, long haul. <laughs> I think we're good to go. Let's go. Let's go. So first we have a couple of volumes I've actually already opened because they came in packaging that didn't look like manga packaging. <laughs> I was like, what the heck's this? So we have my romantic, my youth romantic comedy is wrong as expected comic. So this is volume 14. I only have volume one, but this was on sale from almost 50% off. You're going to notice that a lot when it's like, why have you picked that up when it's out of order? Because it was on sale. I'll talk a bit about how much I think I've spent on things as I go along, if I can remember. But yes, so that's our first volume of the whole. The next one I opened accidentally, it was New Game Volume 4, so I'm missing Volume 3. I am absolutely in love with this series, especially because they've introduced characters who do the same job as me. <laughs> it's so nice to see your job role in manga and represented by women, hashtag girls who code. They're so thin though, it's really disappointing that this is a 10.99 series and you get this much content. So that's why I've picked up four, because it was on sale and I don't want to buy these for full price. Next one I'm going to open is one that was already slightly opened. So this didn't arrive like this. It was a bit ripped and then I picked it up and kind of swung it by mistake and it completely tore open. So this was my fault. But let's, let's, let's pull them out one at a time. I don't want this video to be crazy long. So I'm not going to potentially talk about each volume as much as I would do normally because you've seen how many parcels there are. I genuinely don't think I know how many are here. We're going to have to do a count at the end. <laughs> so we've got AI Love You Volume 6. This was second hand. It's a Tokyo Pop volume. It's in pretty good condition. Actually, it's in that yellow. I think that's out of print. Actually, it's Tokyo Pop. Of course it's out of print. What's wrong with me? Then we have Radiant Volume 5. I think I got this for like three pounds. Um, I've read Volume 1 and I really enjoyed it to the point that I recommended it to Geeky. Uh, I hope you enjoy it too. It's a manfra. I didn't know that was a thing. It's a French manga. It's so neat. Reminds me a bit of a um, fairy tale. Millennium Snow Volume 1. So this is by the same artist as Uran. I think it's only four volumes and it's got vampires and I do enjoy vampires. So I'm looking forward to this. And it's only four volumes, so it shouldn't take me too long to complete. Ooh, here. Absolute Duo Volume 2. Um, so this is one I've got volume one of, sort of a fantasy kind, it's like borderline edgy-ish, very pretty. And the last one in this bag, whoosh, Claymore volume nine. This is a series I'm trying to piece together. I potentially should have just picked up the box set in hindsight, but, oh well. <laughs> I am picking it up this way instead. So I have like volumes one, two, 
Oh dang it, I can't quite see it because of the chair. But more clay moth. Let's just pick another one. So this will be some more secondhand stuff. Let's get the scissors. Snip. Snip. And we've got ooh, Clockwork Planet Volume 1. That's big. I didn't realise it was a big volume. Uh, this was second hand from the creator of No Game No Life. I think this is 10 volumes. It's a little battered, but again, I think this was for five pounds when it retails for 9 99 Maybe, no, four, I don't know, I can't remember. I bought that one ages ago. Okay, and there's the second one in here and it is Wild Ones Volume 3. So I have volumes one and three now. It's down there somewhere. Yep, it's down there, I only have volume one. Um, I think this is potentially out of print. Oh my gosh, the sticker says it was $5.99. I don't remember if his volume's ever been $5.99. That must be before my time. <laughs> um, yeah, it's meant to be a good shoujo, so I'm trying to pick up what I can find since I can't. It seems to be out of print. Let's look at that. Let's. Should we do now? Let's do this one. This one's heavy. This one's an Amazon. The Manga Guide to Cryptography! Now, I have not seen, let me check what the other one is, I think the other one is, yep. So the other one is the Manga Guide to Microprocessors. I haven't seen anyone else with these in their collection. These are amazing. This was actually, so the Manga Guide to series was some of the first manga things I had in my collection. So I had, I got the Naruto and the Love Hina first, and then my dad bought me a whole bunch of these Manga Guide 2s. And they're just amazing. So they're all on different topics and they teach you things. So there's usually a story that you follow along with and there's some, let's find some actual like, so you'll have actual manga, but along the way, They'll teach you about, they'll actually teach you about whatever the topic of the book is. So one of the other manga guides is the manga guide to statistics and I kid you not, I used that book to pass my GCSE statistics exam. I got an A. And it, but it went beyond GCSE, it must have gone at least up to A level. And it's so good and because I, it's got a story, I find it a lot easier to follow and also it's manga. <laughs> So, Manga Guide to Microprocessors and the Manga Guide to Cryptography. I think there's there's 14 published in English and I learned there were some that I didn't have. Um, but I think overall there's like 56 in Japanese. I sure hope they publish some more. There are some amazing ones, it's like the Manga Guide to Calculus, the Manga Guide to Electricity, Manga Guide to the Theory of Relativity is a personal favourite of mine. <laughs> They're the super neat. So if you're wanting to learn about a subject, go see if there's a manga guide to it. It helps. Nice box here. Let's open the box. And it's time for the box cutter. I don't want to cut the manga. Let's not judge my box opening skills. Cool. Oh, you can kind of kind of see what's on top. Down packing peanuts. All right. So I placed a lot of pre-orders on Amazon. I I have all my pre-orders for like till the end of June. Um, there was a lot of manga that was meant to come out in February that didn't ship to me because Amazon was out of stock. And I noticed that Traveling Man had all of it. Well, not all of it. They had about some volumes in stock and they were about a pound fifty cheaper each than on Amazon. So I saved money really. <laughs> so we have volume one, uh, volume six of Love Me, Love Me Not. Which I've been waiting for. I've seen people with volume seven and I was sat there going Don't have volume six. <laughs> then we've got one of my favourite series at the moment, which is Kaguya-sama, Love is War, volume 18. Ah, the, 
it's just so good. I do a review, I've done a review video on this. So if you want to know my thoughts on it, go, go watch that. And what I'm gonna definitely not do is stop the video and read this now. <laughs> no, no, because, no, put this down, put this down. Okay, next we have Fly Me to the, Fly Me to the Moon, <laughs> volume three. This has been super cute so far. And the covers are gorgeous. I wasn't sure at first. I picked it up because I kind of liked the name of the series, Fly Me to the Moon. And I liked that the lead dude is called NASA after the space organization. <laughs> it's, it's like it's like a reverse romance where they've they've gotten married and now they're getting to know each other. And then I've also got an incurable case of love, volume six. This bad boy was meant to ship to me in January, but you didn't, did you? No, you didn't. I only realised, like, after I ordered this from Travelling Man, that there's only seven volumes. Oh gosh, I've only got one more and then it's done. Alright, okay. Ooh, the sights peek up on the screen. Alright, what else have we got? Hunter x Hunter, volume 18. Hunter x Hunter is impossible to find at the moment, don't know why. So I have 1 to 4 and 21 and now 18. I'm again trying to pick them up when I can find them on sale. And this was like £4.80. Almost three for two prices, so good for that. I might need to change that. Reorganise that stuff before it falls. What else have we got? There's just one more. Oh, that hench. A hench volume. Pokemon Adventures. Heart Gold and Soul Silver Volume 2. So the Heart Gold Soul Silver arc is only two volumes long. I don't understand the numbering for Pokemon Adventures. They, they were mostly going continuous, even though they were changing games, and then at some point they just revert back to one. That's not helpful for my spreadsheet. <laughs> Look how big that is compared to like Hunter x Hunter. Hydration time. open this one. I find it's easier with scissors on the plastic. Plastic ones. We've got Triage X2. Oh, it was a bit battered. But a lot of, a lot of bumps. I hear that this is going out print pretty sharpish. Um, I only have volume one, so I have volume two. I actually have some chronological <laughs> secondhand manga for once. Um, I was unsure about volume one. I didn't fully understand what was happening. There just seemed to be a lot of people in not much clothing and they were nurses. I think that might actually be the story, but maybe I just need to read more. All that, that is all there is to it, maybe. Let's do, let's do another Amazon. Let's do another Amazon. Oh no, that's, that's barely attached at all. What do we have? Oh my god! I saw people on Instagram picking this volume up in like early December, late November. And I was sat there all the way up till like, I think this shipped two weeks ago. So I'm three to four months behind. US. Oh my goodness, I, it was getting really good at the end of volume 25 as well. This is, this is the problem, when I get lots of pre-orders of my favourite series, it's then it's like, what do I read first? I want to read them all first. How do you read, how do I read seven volumes at once? <laughs> That's my Google search history. Ah! <laughs> Let's do another Amazon one because it's, it's right here. less satisfying. Oh, that is heavy! Solo leveling the graphic novel. Oh, hang on, hang on a minute. I think this reads left to right. Does not compute. I think this is a box, what's it called? Man, man, manhwa? Is it manhwa? Korean? Korean manga? Oh, it's fully in colour. I did not, that explains why it was more expensive. <laughs> that is, that 
is one heavy manga. Goodness me. I have heard this is really good. I thought it was an isekai just just because of the title. I think it's just a fantasy. Unless I'm wrong. I've heard a lot of people raving about it and raving about the light novel, which I've picked up as well. You know, I picked up this and the light novel at the same time. The light novel shipped from the US and it arrived before this. <laughs> I just have the worst luck when it comes to pre-ordering and shipping manga. Goodness me. It's a lot of pages. Almost doesn't feel like a manga with how colourful it is. Oh, it smells funny. I'm a bit weird about manga glue. Manga glue smells funny and people are like, what are you talking about? It doesn't smell of anything. All right, let's try this one. Bunch. So let's pull them out one at a time. We have the Gentleman's The Gentleman's Alliance. Is it cross? Oh cross. Gentleman's Alliance Cross. Oh my gosh. I got that. Volume 6. I've got a whole bunch of these, I think. Because I don't know if it's out of print or just the UK is a bit crap at the moment. <laughs> I can't find anything. Alice 19th volume 7. Um, this is out of print, I'm fairly sure. Yeah, that's a really old Viz logo. Um, it's the same author as Fushigi Yuki. There's only seven volumes, which really disappoints me. It's called Alice 19th, but there's like seven volumes. Um, I think there's a bunch of those in this haul. Rosario Vampire Season 2, volume 10. Is again slightly hench. That's pretty good condition. It doesn't look that yellowed. Although I don't have, I haven't read all of season one because I don't have all of season one <laughs> just yet. But I am on my way. Dot Hack Legend of Twilight. I hear this is an isekai and based on a video game. Or oh, there's a video game based on this. I think the video game came first. And there's a whole bunch of these. The number one manga in America. That's probably still not the true. There's a lot of manga in America. Last one in this pack. The Gentleman's Alliance Volume 9. Gentleman's Alliance Cross. Why can't I remember your name? I'm so sorry. <laughs> so exciting. I'll pick you and I'll pick you. Ah. Right, let's do... This is alone a singular Amazon. <laughs> Hybrid Heart Volume 2. I feel like Amazon shamed me with this volume when it gave me the little toast notification on my phone saying it is on its way, it's been dispatched. The little toast only had like that pit of the cover in it. It's like, hmm, okay, okay, Amazon, don't. Don't shame me for my manga choices, okay? I get it. I'm a degenerate. Don't remind me. <laughs> Toilet Bounds, Hanukkah Con Volume 7! Look how gorgeous it is. Right. I... this is... this is potentially one of the prettiest series I own. This, Toilet Bound to Kun and Witch Hat Atelier are very much fighting each other for top place in prettiest manga in my collection. Volume 7 came out ages ago and again didn't ship. Volume 8 is meant to come out shortly. I have that one on pre-order but we'll see. We'll see how long that one takes to arrive. Come on, come on, come on. This is a suspicious unmarked. Oh wait, yeah, I took my addresses off everything. But this is this is a very clean envelope. What's in it? I can't remember. Oh, just back and forth. Further, further past. 
packing more cardboard. Goodness. It is well protected. Rip it, give me my mango. Oh my gosh. I did not realize this was brand new. Is it brand new? So we have Vinland Saga volume 11. I have volumes one, two, and three. And then you're like, why have you picked up volume 11? I picked up volume 11. So this normally retails for about 22 99 each. I bought this for £7.50. I thought it was second hand. It's wrapped in plastic. It's brand new. This is a brand new volume that I got from a third of the price. Oh. <laughs> I'm so proud of myself. That is insane. I mean, the plastic's a bit ripped there, but it just looks like it just looks like something's caught it. It doesn't. Oh my god. I'm so, so proud. I'm so proud of myself. I can't even tell if we're halfway through. Do I have a problem? No. It's not a problem. It's a fun hobby, right? Right? Okay, right. Let's do let's do another Amazon. This is I already think I know what this one is because of its size and I think. This is, yes, this is another manga guide to regression analysis. Now, this is like more statistics. Oh my gosh, I love statistics. That's the main reason I've got a really intense manga spreadsheet. If you're interested about my manga spreadsheet, there is a link down below. Um, it's so I can get six stats, like charts and line graphs and Ah. <laughs> apply, I'm gonna apply this to my spreadsheet. Where are my ma other manga guides too? <laughs> right, got another scissor time. Don't really, don't really need the box cutter one as much. It's got a few in it. Let's... Does it want to come out? Come on. There we go. Gentleman's Alliance Cross. Yay! Volume 4. Um, this one's a bit battered, it's got some gross residue on the back, but I can wipe that off. Oh, this is by the same person who did Full Moon, I thought. <laughs> so when I opened Full Moon as part of my manga care package share box from Himika, I was like, I swear this artist does look familiar. I have absolutely no idea. It's Gentleman's Alliance Crafts. What's the other one? Brave Master Volume 6, £1.50. Where in hell was this £1.50? I swear I looked up how much a full set of Brave Master is on eBay. $500 was about the lowest I could find. I'm starting to feel maybe I shouldn't pick up the singles and I should save up and buy a whole set at once because some of the later volumes are apparently just impossible to find but whole sets are a bit more common but then do i want to drop that much on mango at once i say as i look at my desk full of manga packages but i really like fairy tale and i really like eden zero so i do quite badly want to read this because this one's meant to be pretty good too let's keep going this is honestly such such wonderful fun Oh, it looks dirty. Oh, it's just the artwork. <laughs> we have Cromarty High School, Volume 7. This is a comedy. I think there's 20 or 18, uh, 18 volumes or something, but they only published 11 in English, which is super sad. Um, but it's absolutely hilarious. It's such weird humour. This is Good quality. This is a, this is an out of print series. This is one of my out of print collections at the moment. Do, do, do. Snip, 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 snip. One pair of scissors. Waiting for spring, volume eight. Um, this is this is super sweet. Nice high school romance. Gorgeous coloured spines. Um, I've I've this, this I've definitely started picking these out. Can these up out of order because I've got this is volume eight, and I have I have volumes one to four, so a definite out of order purchase. 
but again it was cheap it was like four pounds which is more than 50 percent off almost cleared this side down then we just got this and here we've got daytime shooting star volume 10 i think we're nearly at the finish i think there's only 12 or 13 volumes of this another high school romance I'm unsure at the moment. I really like him. He's so nice. What's wrong with her? What's wrong with her? Why is she being? Why is she being the way she is? Ugh, such such a beautiful blue. Beautiful blue. I just oh, it's so pretty. How do I decide what to start with first? <laughs> Last box on this side. What do we have? Oh gosh. Heavier than I thought it would be. This is the this. reboot. Space Battleship Yamato, which is I think a collection. Originally they were in smaller, less books than this. And it's an older one. Look out. Thick. Seven C's and hard work. That was satisfying. I feel this potentially isn't safe, but we'll, we're gonna roll with it and see how it, how it does. Let's start on this side. Another Amazon. Oh, that was disappointing. <laughs> we Never Learn, volume 14. So this is a harem slice of life, high school, slice of life, high school harem thing. I think it's finishing shortly, 21 or 22 volumes. I quite like it, but there's one girl I prefer over the rest, and I hope he gets with her, but also I don't like him that much. I quite like all the girls, but I don't like him. But gorgeous cover. <laughs> you stay there. Now she's staring at me and I feel uncomfortable. <laughs> There's a good view in there. Snip, snip, snip. Snip. Right, what we got first? We have another Claymore, Claymore Volume 15, second hand, not much yellowing. Then we've got AI Love You Volume 3. Yeah, Volume 3, second hand. These are really thick volumes. And then that. I do like matte volumes. I'm already running out of space. This was a mistake. Oh my gosh, Dot Hack, Legend of the Twilight Volume 3. Can you see that Volume 1 up here? The difference in thickness. Let's put a new game, new game. This, cheaper than this, just saying. <laughs> Another AI Love You Volume 2. So that's, I have one, two, three, and six. <laughs> I think there's nine volumes. It's the same artist as Love Hina, which I love for all the nostalgic reasons. Of course, I flip it open to a bath scene. Of course, okay. <laughs> What's the last one in here? Another Dot Hack, Dot Hack GU Plus Volume 2. So I have volume one already up there somewhere because this is the beginning of the alphabet for me. A dot, a dot, meh. <laughs> also look how vibrantly pink this is. Goodness me, come on. I love bright colorful. It stands out against all the brown and the gray and the white. What have we got? What have we got? We've got Anonymous Noise volume four. This is a like, musical, the musically themed shoujo high school romance there's 18 volumes and they're all vibrantly bright rainbow colors i wasn't sure on volume one um but i have two three and four to try i keep forgetting to show some of the insides or oh, what is happening there I'm always a bit un 
unsure about showing the insides because I think I accidentally spoiled a volume when I've done that before. So I'm now more wary. I kind of like, you can see the, the art in action, but I think that's just me. We've got the reprise of Spear Hero Volume 1. I am absolutely loving the Rise of Shield here. Is it the Rise or Rising? It's the Rising. Where is it? It's right there. Uh, rising. Rising of Shield Hero. I'm really enjoying. So I really wanted to try the spin off. I wasn't sure how far into the series I should get before trying the spin off because I don't want spoilers. But I think I'm far enough in now that I'll be good because I'm on volume. I've, got, I've just gone past the end of season one of the anime because it's one of the few animes I've actually seen. <laughs> Real good. Right, let's do this. Let's do this big one. Oh, he's got to stay hydrated. This is, this is box, box cutter. Box cutter time. It's a bit, a bit battered. But hopefully, contents are fine. Oh my gosh. Ooh. Oh. Right. So much rubbish. So we have another manga guide to physiology this time. Look at the little like food stuffs up here. The human body up close and personal in manga form. Let's learn about the digestive system and the citric acid cycle, how we break down food, how the body regulates temperatures and vital fluids. This is like a more advanced version of cells at work. <laughs> and then we have Pokemon Adventures Fire Red and Leaf Green Emerald, um, which is seven volumes of Pokemon goodness. Pokemon. Can I cut this? aggressive noise list is I don't usually keep the box sets. I generally don't go for box sets anyway but this worked out at two pounds fifty a volume I think. What is going on with volume 26? This this dinky tiny one what is happening? What happened there? You got 25 which is crazy hench and then 26 which is super dinky well, there's a bit of rip there, but again, because I'm not, I'm probably going to get rid of the box, sorry, or put it at the top of my shelves like I've done with some of the other ones, like my bleach one. Oh, oh this is, come on. Manga. There we go. Arasama Teacher Volume 2. So now I have one, two, and another one. Um, it's a show drawer I just want to collect because I hear it's good. I, I, it's like 20 something volumes. I think it's finished though. So another one I'm picking up second hand. Let's do this one. This one I think shipped from the States. Fairly sure I ordered it like three, four weeks ago and it arrived yesterday. So we have volume nine of Waiting for Spring. That's a bit of a sticker there. Take that off though. A um, little battered around the edges. Gorgeous green color. And a Waiting for Spring volume six. Oh, that's just, oh, that came off really easily. Great. How nicely colored these are. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, six, eight, nine. Yeah. That makes sense, right? I don't need the other bits of story, I can work it out, surely. <laughs> Another one. This is the Rising of Shield Hero 13, yay! So I've got, I've got one to 12, so I can read this one straight away. Oh 
no, I've got so many, I couldn't reach straight away. Um, I've also ordered volume 15 because it was somewhere else on sale. I'm just missing 14 and then, and then I think I'm up to date unless 16 comes out soon. I don't know. And then I'm up to date, which is great. And then maybe I need to start looking at the light novels because apparently there's more information in those. And here, you dashing giant box you. I feel there's a lot of manga in here. <laughs> Just wild guess. I don't know I don't know what's making me think that. Oh, how am I even opening this? This is I can't even tell where they join, I'm just making a join. There we go. With this box, oh, it's just fold after fold. Ooh, isn't it? Isn't it so nice to open a box? It's just overflowing with mango. Right, let's. You are in my face. Right, so we have got Let's Dance the Waltz Volume One. I think this is only three volumes. Honestly, I don't know much about it, but it was really cheap, and I thought, why not give it a go? The art looks familiar though. I'll look that up later. This is, I'm fairly sure this, I don't remember ordering this much. Yeah, this goes all the way down to the bottom. Oh, that's packing. Rest is mango. Let's do some more visible ones. Claymore, volume six. We've got some more Gentleman's Alliance Cross, volumes three and four. Well, so we, what? What? Why have they sent me two? Why have they sent me two? What am I gonna do with two? I definitely didn't order two. I was so particular because last time I did accidentally order two of one volume. I was so particular this time. I did not order two. They've sent me two. What? They've done it again. A Gentleman's Alliance Cross 4! What? I don't understand. Maybe they were just getting rid of stock. <sighs> Do I have any more duplicates? Rosario Vampire Season 1 Volume 10, not a duplicate. Oh my goodness. Gentleman's Alliance Volume 5. Not a duplicate. <laughs> Orisama Teacher Volume 7. I quite like the colours, I like, so they're not horrendously colourful spines, but they're nice, a nice two-tone text down the side. D. Grayman Volume 6, so I think this now fills a gap in the D. Graymans that I've got. All right, next we have Air Gear Volume 4. I'm unsure if it was a mistake for me to start picking this up because it's out of print and there's like 30 volumes. Um, but, oh well. <laughs> Interviews with Monster Girls Volume 3. This was like three pounds. It was amazing. So, so cheap. So cheap. <laughs> Bridge the gap. Arisama Teacher Volume 8. Um, there's a funky sticker on the back there. QQ Sweeper Volume 2. Um, I picked up Queen's Quality, is that what it's called? It's up there somewhere. I think it's Queen's Quality. Not realising that it was the sequel to this. So I decided to pick this up before I read Queen's Quality. And Volume 2 was on sale second hand. So I picked this one up and I'll pick up, I think there's only three. So I'll pick up one and three, and then read that, and then move on to Queen's Quality. Jim Littleman's Alliance Cross Volume 11. Is it meant to be that yellow? Is that actually how it is? The rest of the volume doesn't look yellow. That's quite good, actually. Okay. Shugi Yugi Genbu, Genbu Gaiden Volume 2. Um, I think there's like three or four different 
Kushuka Yugi's, right? You have Mysterious Play, you have this one, and then there's a newer one which begins with a B. I think, I think. Gentleman's Lions Cross 10, so I think I have most of this now. I think I'm only missing two volumes. Plus, oh, maybe that's I've got all the bonus volume falls. <laughs> Idle Dreams Volume 1. Again, I don't know much about it other than it was like two pounds. <laughs> so at that price, I'll give it a go. I think it's a romance it's as far as I as much as I know. Monster Soul Volume 1. So this one really interests me because I knew I didn't I hadn't even heard of this one, but this is another Hero Mishima. Mishima? 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 Don't judge me. I only read. Um, same guy as Fairy Tale, Eden Zero, Rave Master, and it's a two volume series. Let's see? Might as well with how much I've enjoyed all his other stuff. I'm hoping this will be easier to find the Rave Master because I think he did that after Fairy Tale or during Fairy Tale. I'm not sure. I've got Alice 19th volume 3, so one, actually there's some more here, Alice 19th volume 2, that's getting very unstable, Alice 19th volume 4, I really like the covers of these, that's, that's a new of his logo, it's a nice, I like that, that's such good purple. Alice 19th volume 6 uh, Yep, so I think I'm only missing volume 5 of Alice 19th I've got 1 and then I've got 2, 3, 4 and then I think there's a 5 somewhere in there and 6 and finally I've got Nisekoi volume 17 I have 1 to 6 at the moment and this was £3 so I picked it up so, um, Gorgeous covers, so bright. Must say, considering how badly my last big order from this place was, this was a breath of fresh air. That was so well packed. Besides the fact they've sent me like duplicates <laughs> for some reason. We're nearly, nearly at the end. This is, this is all we've got left. Which one should we do? Should we do a smaller one? some reason. Let's do the small one. No particular reason. What have we got? What have we got? We have got, let's put the first one, Pluto volume three. So I have volumes one and two so I can actually read this one straight away. Oh, it's got a fold. Did the first two have folds? Yeah, they did. And then we also have Arifureta from Commonplace to World's Strongest volume three. I have Volumes one, I think, potentially volume two is in one of these. Um, it's another East Kai. I find it pretty dark considering how lighthearted it starts out. But I think there's only like six volumes of manga out at the moment. Ascendance of a Bookworm volume three. Well, Ascendance of a Bookworm part one volume three because they've done the damn thing that Re Zero did. This one's blue. Another isekai. Poor girl just wants to read. She just wants to read a book. That's all she wants. But there are no books for the poor in her isekai life. So we've got Apothecary Diaries Volume 2. It's got a sticker on it. A sticker on it that says brand new. Great, thanks. Um, I think I'm up to date with this now. I think there's only two out, or volume three is coming out shortly. It's pretty neat. The Devil's a Part-Time, volume 16. So I have volume one. And of course, why do I pick up volumes out of order? Because it's on sale. This was three pounds. Brand new on Amazon. When it's usually 9.99 or 10.99. Last parcel. Thank you for sticking with me trying to decide if I should split this into two parts at the moment. I don't want crazy long videos, but also I was kind of hoping this would be one video. 
I don't want it to be like three hours long. Uh, we'll see when I start editing. How Not to Summon a Demon Lord, Volume 1. This one's the light novel. I have the manga. I tried to buy this like a month ago and they sent it out to me and it was the manga and I messaged them saying, I ordered the light novel and you've sent me the manga and they went, oh, okay. Came back to me and went, yeah, we listed it wrong. Sorry, we don't have the light novel. We're refund you your money and you don't need them. You don't need to return the manga. And I'm like, I've already got the manga. What do I do with this? Now I've actually got the light novel. Yay. I've only recently started delving a little into light novels. I have some and it's been good so far. I have quite a lot of volume one, so I haven't got much past volume ones, and a lot of them are series that I've already read, the manga of, or seen the anime. Yeah. Right. I've also got Skeleton Knight in Another World. Would you be surprised to hear that this is an isekai? And I learnt that it's an isekai I didn't have, so I picked it up. <laughs> That's, yeah. Seven Seas, so it's... It might, I wonder if it's going to remind me of Overlord just because of Skeleton Dude, but we'll see. We'll see. We've got Volume 2 of Dragon's Rioting. I don't think there's many volumes in this series. Basically, it's a bad etchy and I love it because I'm a terrible person. <laughs> a degenerate. Absolute terrible weep. <laughs> and the final volume. The final volume. We have made it. We've made it. I've made it. The final volume is Arifretta Volume 2, which isn't a horrendous surprise considering I have Volume 3 and I said that I only had Volume 1. We're done. I'm going to ignore the horrendous mess we've got on the floor. I need to go get a bin bag. Goodness me, what have I done? Uh, this is like more than a shelf's worth of manga. Do I regret it? No, oh, silly question. <laughs> All right, let's let's get these let's, hydration. Hydration. Good to stay hydrated. All right, I'm gonna now move these. Having done some reorganisation and some counting, I think there is about eighty-five-ish something volumes here. When I started, when I decided to start keeping the parcels for. A video I thought I'd have about 40 and that's evidently got that's grown <laughs> quite a bit also having gone through the stack not only did I have one extra volume in the gentleman's crossway but I had two extra volumes that I just didn't realize so if you're interested in the gentleman's alliance cross volume 4 leave a comment down below if you're interested in claim of volume 6 leave a comment down below and if anyone is interested, I'll send them to you. I don't care where you are, because what am I gonna do? <laughs> Goodness me, I now need to decide what to read first. Usually it's my like up-to-date series, so where are those, where are those? Cool, so now I have stacked my basket and these are all the series that I'm currently up to date with. So they're going to be my first read. So we got We Never Learn, The Apothecary Diaries, Sense of a Bookworm, Kaguya-sama, Love Me, Love Me Not, My Hair Academia, A Curable Case of Love, Toilet Bound and Okakon, Daytime Shooting Star, and Fly Me to the Moon. Let's see how quickly I can read all of these. And then all of this, I need to put it away. Oh my god. I hope you liked the wide range of manga that I got and the amount. Goodness me, it's just so much. Don't forget to give my video a like and if you've enjoyed it, why not subscribe? I'll be posting more crazy, silly hauls like this because I can't help myself and I just love manga. If you've enjoyed this haul, why not follow me on Instagram? I post some really neat, funky pictures of my hauls on there and I'm posting daily in my stories, see what I'm up to, what manga I'm reading at the point that time. Otherwise, I'm going to disappear off to go and read the billion volumes of manga. Thank you for joining me and I'll see you next time. Bye.